Don't mind me, I'm just practicing my idle animation, you know. Normal human things. <laughs> We're doing meta human creator. And it's gonna be great. I hope. I'm trying to make myself once again using a new tool that just came out for Unreal Engine. I don't know if you've seen it before, but... Meta human creator. I think everything that has this little, this little warning message here is pretty much experimental. My meta humans. Okay, there's no meta humans here. Mohawk, man. That looks nice. Nice and curly. That might be a nice starting point for me. I mean, I got a little bit of man bun myself. He's got a beard. He does, in fact, have a nose. That is um, something I have. I have a nose. He's got the hair. He's He's got the beard. He does have eyebrows. It's, it's pretty impressive, actually. Can I turn that guy around? Yeah. While I'm at it. Got his shirt on. Look at that. I'm so far zoomed in. Did the LD on the skin just update even more? There's like pores to it. It's not cinematic level of greatness. Not Thanos from Weather Digital. <laughs> this is real time after all. I mean, who am I to complain? I I'm not complaining. This is amazing, this stuff. So how do I get started? Mm, blend skin, face. We got the face camera. We got the body camera. Nice A pose going here. Torso camera. There's like three different types of clothing here. Four, five, crotch cam, six. <laughs> okay, let's go back to the face. I thought this was gonna be a nice starting point because this guy has a... This is so defined, yeah. The LOD on this is insane. Body types. Ah, that's an easy start. I mean, there's an obvious body type for me. Tall and big. Ah, it's close enough. I mean, you don't... <laughs> Look at that belly. Man! <laughs> Didn't think I would say this, but this is a little bit much, huh? <laughs> That's not what I look like. Let's do some future predictions. Let's go with a little bit more of a more normal body type. I'm not that lean, but who cares? I have the technology. And I'm I'm just gonna pull up some reference shots. I, I can just plop these in here. I got an x-ray of my teeth in here. <laughs> look at that. If I need more details... <laughs> I can go under the skin. <laughs> Chroma blending, color correction, opacity. I think I should make it slightly bigger still. Half my face, half his face. I mean, I just got a different face, huh? Wait, the render quality is still medium. High is ray traced. Yo, it can get better. What if I like really want to modify that note? I don't even know if the program can do it. The kind of note that I have, it's going to the extremes. Sculpt. That all the options I have? Like, you can't make it crazy. You can't even make it look like my nose. I gotta tuck that way in. I gotta make it grayish. Oh, the limbus, I think that's the, the outside. Yeah, oh, I gotta make, I gotta make mine like real dark. That already looks like a lot more like my eyes would. Got the veiny eyes. I got yellow eyes. Got a genetic condition here. Kinda makes my eyes a little bit yellow. Ooh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, yeah. Some tweaking and then I get there. Okay, I gotta move them all the way back in there. Everything starts with a bunch of symmetry. Those eyes are too big. It's kinda, kinda getting there. Salt and pepper. Hehehe. <laughs> okay, no. That still doesn't look like me. Like the eyes, I messed it up again. I keep messing it up again and again. It won't really let me do my eyes. My eyes don't really exist here. Like this still doesn't look like me. The head is so big. If you look in the mirror, heads, I mean, they kinda are that big. Maybe from really far away, just from the shoulders up, this could pass for me. Eye color is there. Like that's the best part so far. The eye color, that is me. I think I nailed that one. I have a body. Oh no! What am I? What am I gonna do? Hands? What are hands? Look at my hands! Woo wee! That's a bit far out, but it's not wrong. Oh, 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 oh! The jaw. Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey. Um, I could turn the um hair off, and I think there's a button for that. Aha. Okay, those those lips have to be tucked in a little bit. Upper lip. You look good without any hair, I guess. We're just used to having facial hair. <laughs> it's easier to take the hair off than it is um, to put it back on. <laughs> but then it's not textured that nicely. Oh boy. I mean, that's one thing to get right. They just don't have my nose. <laughs> Keep tweaking the same settings over and over. I wish I could move it up more. Like. 
Just unlock these constraints here. Make more extreme faces. Like, by pure happenstance, I just... Yeah. It's not actually... It's actually not even that far from what I'm wearing right now. Short is gonna look really funny. Huh? Short girl. <laughs> nice. Ah, this is so mean. I actually have shoes like that. That's, that's not even bad. Pale, pale, pale. Think pale. Not gray. I'm sure the lighting isn't doing me any favors in that uh, reference picture. I'm not that red. It's uncanny. No, it's not uncanny. It's like it's leaving. It's about to leave the uncanny belly. Uh, the nose. They don't have my nose. Face. Range of motions. Or I could go from studio lighting to indoor lighting. Get a nice out outdoor. Oh, ooh, silhouette. You know the silhouette? That is something that might pass. Just the outline? Who knows, hmm? Hey, we, we gotta get you, gotta get you a new pair of teeth. My teeth are much more yellow than I thought. I have a 3D scan of my teeth, so that's gonna make things a lot easier. This right here is a scan of my teeth. Like, this is, this is actually my teeth. <laughs> Ding ding! I put the same glasses on. Like, I, I just take a model of these glasses. Ooh! G Bablin! What's up? Hey. I gotta turn the redness way up. But then also the beard. I think I gotta make that a little bit lighter still. What do you make? I'm using MetaHuman, which is like an early access. It's for Unreal Engine. It's from Epic Games. And it's like a photorealistic, uh, real time video game avatar creator to make characters for video games or all kinds of like real-time applications for that matter you can see these individual strands of hair here what's got more detail <laughs> real life or meta human like if you're just looking at the mouth i mean the one on the right is obviously rendered it's getting kind of close some blur filter or something crazy <sighs> me with facial hair me, me without facial hair if you just take this for a green screen outline there's no way you could tell this could really just be like a mask, like a pass uh, that you pull from a, like a chroma key. Very powerful double bun. Keep saying that every time. Like I thought games were photorealistic like 10 years ago, but for some reason uh, they keep getting better every time. It's kind of popping, eh? <laughs> time to buy some fake lashes and eyeliner. <laughs> if you want to use MetaHuman, uh, you can do that by um, signing up for the Early Access program. There's a website for it. I'm sure you can find it if you just search MetaHuman Creator. It's completely cloud-based, I think, so you don't even have to have like a 3090, RTX 3090, any crazy graphics card, I'm sure, as long as you can stream whatever they're sending over here. Uh, you can make your own MetaHuman Creator character and get into your games, applications. Real-time rendering projects, sponsored stream. I wish. I'm just excited about this. If you like what you saw uh, and you are not following yet, I don't know, stream end times. Should we raid someone? I don't have anyone in mind. 